So Intel is the largest chip manufacturer out there, but they've had a hard time getting to the Android tablet space. So today we're taking a look at the Acer Icona Tab 8, which is an 8-inch Android tablet powered by the Intel Big Drill processor, a quad-core processor and also packed with 2 gigs of RAM. So this thing has a lot of processing power. Um, this is an x86 chipset, so you've got a lot of power in there. You've got a 5 megapixel rear camera at the back, and um, it comes with 16 gigabytes of internal storage in there. You've got a 2 megapixel front-facing camera, and the display is 8 inches at 1900 by 1200 um, uh, resolution. So it's got a full 1080p display, micro SD card um, expansion up to 64 gigabytes. And of course, you've got a uh, mini HDMI out. Uh, you've got your micro USB for charging and a headphone port. And on the right hand side of the tablet, you do have uh, power volume rockers. The screen is a four by three aspect ratio here. So um, this thing really fits the whole tablet mode. Now, as I said, this is an Android based tablet. What it means is running Android 4.4.2, pretty close to you know, latest version of Android out there. And it's almost a stock experience. Um, what you will find though, it's loaded with a lot of bloatware, uh, which luckily does not slow down the system performance. Uh, I didn't notice any major slowdowns whatsoever. It was really easy to use, navigate, uh, but it is a lot of applications just installed there off the bat um, uh, on this tablet, which is kind of a bummer. Now, uh, I don't have a price for you because I don't really have a price for this, but this is supposed to fit into the $150, $200 price range. So this is a very cost-effective and affordable tablet to get, and I like it. You know, I like the performance. I've done some gaming with it, and it runs like any other Android tablet, you know, very well solid, especially uh, the Qualcomm uh, base tablets. Uh, so I, I like that about it, and I think they've done a very good job uh, with that. Uh, there are a couple of features uh, they've had Asus added to. There's a couple of Asus software uh, additives, like unlocking your screen. So you have the knock feature from LG, uh, which basically you just double tap to unlock your screen. In this case, you can use your two fingers by just holding down on the screen and that unlocks your screen. Or you can use five fingers on the screen and that will also unlock your screen for you. So those are nice feature sets and that's like actually a um, good thing overall. Uh, again, like I said, it's a very stock experience, uh, Android. So even the menu system looks that way. You've got some Intel video enhancements built in there. Uh, we also got a few other additives in terms of of just um, software features brought into brought into the tablet. Uh, again, um, it, it's a very fluid experience. I have to mention, and I think that's what helps this this tablet really succeed. The Ace Icona Tab Eight, and something I think a lot of people would definitely appreciate uh, for this year. Again, the screen you hear that's Android four point four point two, uh, the model number uh, for the tablet. So I do like it. I really I really like what they've done here. Now the one if a couple of things I don't like about the tablet, or at least uh, I wish they had improved, even though the price point is the speaker. Speakers are the back, uh, low quality speakers, but I wish they were front firing. And also you do have no flash uh, with that um, camera at the back. So you're not getting the best uh, types of uh, photos, especially at nighttime, if, in case you want to use your tablet. But before we jump in now, let's do a quick sound sample. Uh, I decided to just check out Lachlan's page. He had a Thinkcast, so Lachlan likes a thing. Check out uh, his YouTube channel. Thinkcast number seven. Now this is a live stream as always and you can leave your comments and questions during the stream and I'll try my the funny thing is I actually caught his thing cast live while recording uh, this video. But anyway, that is the Acer Icona Tab 8. It's a very solid tablet from Intel and Acer, uh, powered by the Bajor processor. Uh, solid performance, uh, great use. Battery life is, is actually close to 10 hours instead of 7. So I definitely like it. If you have any questions, any comments, let us know. Don't forget to like this video, share, and favorite. And also, um, do subscribe to the channel, top right-hand corner of your screen or down in the description below. Thunder E saying, Thank you and always enjoy your entertainment.